Hey everyone, welcome back to 5 Day Crypto. My name is Chase. Today is Thursday, February 11th of 2021. And today we're going to talk about XRP, also known as Ripple. It is the current number five ranked coin out of over 8,400 cryptocurrencies. So still quite strong. Market cap, $23 billion. Now, if you don't know, XRP is in a little bit of a hot water right now with the SEC, allegedly. Allegedly. If you don't have any XRP yet, I would perhaps wait until that hearing is over with. If you do have some XRP, let's let's find out what we're looking like and what we could potentially look for in the weeks and months ahead. So the price is up uh, just around 50 cents, 51 cents, up, up 5% on the past 24 hours. Volume is over going down. Volume is down 30%. A lot of coins are made big moves up in volume over the past 24 hours. So that is a little bit of a concern. I can show you why that might be happening in just a moment. If we look at Ripple on the macro trend, this is all of Ripple's history. You can see it has some insane peaks and insane valleys. And just as of late, we're coming back out. We'll see what we think could be happening on, on as far as those little last few peaks are. If you are invested in Ripple, uh, we have some breaking news for you. I don't know if you're aware of this yet. As of about an hour ago, the co-founder of XRP, Jed McCaleb, has offloaded roughly 40 million XRP tokens. So this is current news. So that could be the volume that you see trending down. I don't see that as being a benefit, but that's just me. So let's go look at the charts and we'll see what we can tell could be happening in the future based on the past. So we're looking at this move. That was the end of the 2017 bull run. Uh, it got an astronomical spike here. This was, let's see what we were over all of the 20 week moving average. 350% roughly. That's... If you get over 100% above your 21-week moving average, you're getting an extended bubble territory. So 350% is almost unheard of uh, in any asset. But that that's an impressive climb. And I think that it was trying to do the start some kind of insane move like this again, right here, before this news came out. I think it was trying to do something like this again. That's my honest belief. Uh, I, whether, whether or not you believe in XRP or you don't, you love it, you hate it. I think it was trying to do that move again. The news came out, caught it off guard, dumped back down. That's what this red is. If you're unfamiliar with that. And then I think it's pumping again, not because of anything other than the rest of the alt market is pumping. That's my honest opinion. I know a lot of you don't want to hear that. Uh, but there's the only reason I'm saying that is because there's nothing in the charts that look like a bullish formation to me. We're on a macro downtrend. See here? Down, 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 down. We've only recently started doing again. And even with this, these last few moves, we're at a high, a lower high. We're potentially forming even a, another low uh, until we get start making higher highs. I don't see a lot of benefit in XRP. There's a lot of other coins that are booming right now. Your money, in my opinion, would be better invested in other altcoins that are going to simply outperform XRP in the near future. Based on the past, uh, three-year sideways movement, basically, there's a lot of coins that have outperformed this blindingly. If you're looking to get into XRP, uh, you can do what you want with your money. But like I said, there's other coins that are outperforming it right now, especially with declining volume or down 30% in the past 24 hours. If you are dead set into buying more and want to know what a good level will be to buy in, I would say until we get above this line, roughly 80 cents. Now, if we get above 80 cents, okay. I think there could be bluer skies ahead. That's I'm not all bad news bears. I just look at the charts and I tell you my honest opinion. I don't have anything to sell you. So there's nothing I would benefit off of telling you to sell or buy anything else. I don't 
I, I don't I just make honest videos based on what I see. If I hurt your feelings, I do apologize for that. But I'm not making fun of your coin. I'm not I'm not here to blast anybody. I'm not here to put down anything or hurt anybody's feelings or promote anything that I like over something else. I look at the chart, I blatantly say what I see, and that's all. So that is what I see. 80 cents. If you get above that, see this line, the dotted line here? This is, the, I'm not just pulling 80 cents out of the air here, and it's not just because of this. 80 cents has been a nice place, roughly 80 cents. See all these levels? We had close, hard close here after this huge downfall. That's a closing candle. That's another closing candle. We played with some minor resistance here. It got above it. It tried to get above this. Locked back down, come back up again, tested exactly 80 cents again. Look where we hit again, 80 cents. Eight, 75 to 80 cents is going to be a key level for Ripple. If it can't clear that, I fear we're going to make it. If it's going to clear 80 cents, it's got to do it before all the altcoins fall back down. If it doesn't clear by the time we have a retracement, I don't know that it will. To be blatantly honest, we go back to coin market cap. It is, like I said, it's number five. I do not see it staying there. Until this lawsuit is settled, I have I don't have confidence in XRP. I could see this just maybe it stays here. Maybe if the, if the founding officers are selling, they're not doing it because they need the money. They're already rich my opinion I would watch this like a hawk if you see look click on that news tab if you click on this you can follow the news that updated an hour ago that the co-founder sold 40 million tokens in the past two days that's alarming to me that's a lot now 4 million okay that's that's a lot but it's not 40 million so watch for that Ripple's, I mean, Ripple's still up here. It's still $23 billion is not a kick in the bucket. Now, if this was happening and Ripple was at, you know, rank number 1,000 coin, yeah, we, I'd say exit as fast as possible. But Ripple still has a chance. The fundamentals are still relatively there. The charts don't look catastrophic or anything like that. Nothing warning sign about that. So if you have Ripple, you have a decent amount. I'm not saying sell everything. I'm just saying if you're wanting to purchase more or get in for the first time it might be best to hold off not financial advice but i would if i was looking to invest in ripple i don't have any ripple personally but if i was looking to invest in it and i knew that the founder was offloading 40 million tokens in the past two days the volume is down 30 percent lower high after lower high after lower high that's not what i look for to get in a coin just my honest opinion so hopefully this video helped you out make a decision if you have some you're a big believer in xrp okay i'm not hitting on your coin i'm just blatantly stating facts so i appreciate your time hopefully you found that helpful and i'll see you on the next video thank you guys